Hi, welcome to my studio. I'm Sarah Morley. I'm a professional artist based in Stockport. And this is my studio in Vernon Mill. I paint in oils and I draw in charcoal and mixed media. In the studio, I also teach oil painting and occasionally I run workshops in drawing and mixed media. I'm pleased to say that my weekly painting classes have just started again with some additional safety measures as there are less people than usual and we are all practicing safe distancing. In this short video, I wanted to share with you a few thoughts about my own practice and talk about the importance to me of drawing. This year I've been painting a variety of commissions during lockdown, from my NHS portraits for heroes to a very large landscape for a client in Chicago. I've also been doing a lot of drawing. Drawing's great for expressing feelings. This was something that was really necessary for me at the beginning of lockdown. I also draw from photos when necessary. Here you can see some Manchester and Stockport drawings. And I like to use drawing within collage and mixed media to experiment or to respond in a different way to the subject matter. For example, I've painted this beach on Luskentire Harris several times. When I went there, I was also fascinated by all the little lines made by the water on the sand. This was something I could not express in one of my paintings. But here in this drawing, uh, that's exactly what I was doing. With landscapes, I like to do quick drawings, sketches, on site wherever possible. These sketches get mounted into black, hard-backed sketchbooks and can form the basis of resulting work, sometimes for years afterwards. Here's one of the books from my trip to Scotland in 2017. You can see here there's plenty of drawings and some of them have resulted in some finished work which has since been sold. Here you can see some of the drawings and also some of the paintings um, that have come from the drawings. The image of that turquoise water still continues to haunt me. I also use drawing to experiment with composition and capture detail that you can't see from photographs. This is really important when I'm tackling large landscapes. I've just completed a large panorama painting of Manchester. I visited the site and sketched on several occasions, late afternoon and early evening. This sketch gives the overall feel for the painting. Working from my initial sketches and photographs, I did a large charcoal of approximately the size I wanted the painting to be and it also allowed me to scale up and help me to decide on composition. Here you can see me working on the painting at the halfway stage. Everything has been blocked in with a brush and I've painted a version of the sky. There are still a few issues to resolve. I like the dark tones and shapes of the charcoal sketch and I want some darker tones in the foreground. I think the sky needs breaking up a little. I tend to paint my oils in layers and often use a painting knife. I want my landscapes to have a sculptural quality and plenty of texture. Here at last is the finished painting. The sky has now been resolved, which turned out to be the most difficult thing. The painting is still a little wet. It will take a week or two to dry. It will go back on my drying rack for a bit longer. So that's it from me. I hope you've enjoyed watching. You are very welcome to visit me in my studio. But please ring first to make sure that I'm in and not out sketching somewhere.